you gotta put my chapstick on. I'm like, you gotta get camera ready. <laughs> Welcome everyone. It's me, Oki, on a second episode to this uh, Go Wild Journey series um, that will be held this April. It's coming up. Uh, and and uh, I was gonna say Atlanta, Georgia for some reason. <laughs> In Dallas, Texas, Dallas, Arlington, Texas. Yeah, it's, they say Arlington. Anywho, because that's the Texas city, Dallas, but Arlington, now that I'm thinking about it, right? Dallas, Texas. We'll stick to that, okay? <laughs> it's like, don't think about it too much. <laughs> so we're going to talk about what has been going on since then. I'm going to show you some goodies because I'm excited, especially because we are having Inner Shop at Oki Plans, new releases this coming Friday, the 9th. Today, real time is the 7th, February 7th, so Friday releases, which I'm going to include whatever I can as far as like the Go Wild design, just because I've received the little keychains that I was waiting for, so I'm going to add those. Whatever extras I have, la di da, you guys are going to see. So, to get started, one of the things that I still had left to do, <laughs> it was on my to-do every single week, and I was just not doing it, is booking our flights. Um, we are on the East Coast in Jersey. I'll be flying with my hubby. My hubby's going to be attending. Um, and we knew, I told him, we're not flying spirit. Like, there's no way. And yes, it's the ticket costs less. But honestly, the stress <laughs> that I've experienced with spirit, no, it's not worth it. So, that's something I love. So, um, we ended up booking with American Airlines. Um once again, at the end of this whole journey, I'm going to total up everything we spent <laughs> just so that you guys can see, like, as far as, like, our our experience. Uh, so I'm going to add this price, $848.42, uh, because that's what I spent for two adults flying um, with American Airlines, carry-on um, carry bags included, nonstop, which I didn't want to stop here or there. Uh, and we get to choose our seats because that to me is very important. Like I, I have a, not a fear, but like the, the takeoff and landing, I, my hubby knows I just, I get scared. So he's, <laughs> I need his big arm to feel safe and secure. So yeah, <laughs> so yeah $848 and 42 cents. I'm going to add that to my other expenses. Another thing that happened too, was that, you know, my life is busy, <laughs> so I'm not always on like social media unless I have to post or email, la la la. But I happened to log on and see and notice like on the go wild thing. Oh yeah, because I wanted to see when by when the boxes, the welcome boxes that you're supposed to get are coming. Um, nobody knows. And they didn't have the speakers posted yet, but I just wanted to know like by when they would be arriving. So when I was logging in, they had updated the hotel information. So that's one of the things that I've been noticing that has been uh, not an issue, but a lot of people are coming across not being able to book any more rooms where the main where the main convention conference is going to be held at, which is at the Lowe's in Arlington. That's why I get confused. It's, it says Arlington in the near area. I don't know. I'm like, is it two cities in one or Dallas is just bigger? <laughs> Stop thinking about it, Oki. It's going to bother me. I'm going to look into that. But anyways, uh, the Lowe's in Arlington. So the way that it works is that it's a brand new hotel. Brand new. Awesome. When they first announced the conference and that it was going to be there, people booked right away. Smart thing to do. I didn't decide to go until like November, like the end of November. And that's when we booked it. Um, I think they still had rooms, but like the room booking, it was weird because they only had rooms like Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. No room Saturday, but Sunday, yeah. And I'm like, well, no, like I would need an extra room. So, anywho, the hotel makes a deal with whoever company to give discounted prices. Mind you, they're discounting a brand new hotel room prices. So, awesome. So, if you're able to book there, congrats. <laughs> I'm kind of like, oh, I should have gotten there. But, anyways, then they have a like a nearby hotel that connects to them. It's like the brother sister hotel, um, live at Lowe's. Yeah which connects through a walkway, which is also great. And so they had separated uh, another certain amount of rooms there at a discounted price. You could probably still find rooms there, but the prices are like $300, $400 per night. If you can afford that, great, but it does add up. If you're staying there four nights, five nights, that's like $1,500, $1,500 to $2,000 extra just for the hotel stay where you're just going to sleep. <laughs> 
our situation is different. Yeah, can we afford it? Yeah, but even if I could afford it, I'm not going to spend $300, 400 a night. Heck no. I'd rather spend that money on food <laughs> or buying stuff. So anyways, so they opened that up. So they only had those two hotels. That's why we booked at the Sheraton. Great. So when I went to look for the other information, they had updated the um, they uh, added the Sheraton Hotel that they had discounted rated rooms there. So I was like, oh my gosh, let me go back, logged on, trying to see how much difference it would be because I had already the reservation there. The only thing is that the code is only good for Wednesday through Sunday. We're going there Tuesday. So we would have to pay regular price room on Tuesday and the rest would be discounted. I think it was $159 per night, which was definitely way less than the other one. So great calculations we ended up saving like three hundred dollars once again i'm gonna do all the totals once the whole thing is done <laughs> so i was like saving three hundred dollars heck yeah booked another confirmation uh another made another reservation canceled the first one so that was it i'm so, you know any savings definitely helps i mean i'm so glad they did that because i know a lot of people on that group on facebook were like hey can you like more rooms more rooms and Honestly, I don't think they expected so many more people to sh to want to attend this year, which is great, you know, but at the same time, it does like a lot of people, same thing. We're going to have to Uber. <laughs> I've never used an Uber. I, well, I've used it once with my sister. She's constantly using Uber. So she's like, download the app. She downloaded the app for me. I have to do like the whole, like add my info on it, but I'm going to try to, I'm going to try it out here in Jersey <laughs> just to see how it works by myself. Cause well, I'll be with Johnny, but we're going to have to re rely on Uber. And then I'm thinking like there's a lot of people staying uh, in the hotel that we're at that are going to need Uber. So there's also another Facebook group for people in that hotel to share Ubers. I'm like, oh, my God, that is an amazing idea. We're going to the same place anyways. But I did say that for that day, I think it's like for Friday <laughs> um, that you go in and you have to like I've seen videos of people like running and being there extra like two o'clock, three o'clock in the morning just to get a good like see johnny's like yeah no he was like maybe four o'clock but not not two or three i'm like okay because he wakes up early anyways to go to work so <laughs> so yeah i'm like are we gonna be able to get an uber at that time i'm pretty sure we will but anyways i'm gonna figure something out or maybe find like a car service because then he's like maybe we'll just rent a car but i don't want to have to worry about parking fees and parking fees over there because it's two separate hotels la, 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 la. we're gonna figure it out hopefully so yeah <laughs> so that was that so i was happy that they you know we're able to add more rooms. I think at this point, there's no more. Um, I think you could try to just book any other regular hotel nearby, but some are farther away and so forth. So if you've been thinking about going and you're like, oh my God, you know what? I think I'm just going to go. Don't wait so long because the, the, the longer you wait, the more the rooms nearby and the hotels are going to be booked and you're just going to like, uh, don't be stressed out. Okay, so just do it. Well, do it if you want to do it, but... <laughs> I think it'll be worth it. I don't know. We'll see, right? So far, so far, okay. So that was that. But yeah, there's um another thing too. It's like when you're logging on, if they could, right? If they could just have one main website where you could automatically click to get your ticket, which is this one, the GoWildConference.com. You could get your ticket. It talks about the guest speakers. They're gonna have Martha Stewart as one of the speakers. <laughs> when they posted that, everybody was going nuts. I even told Johnny, I'm like, babe, this Martha Stewart. He was like, is Snoop gonna be there? And I'm like, I don't know, but like Amanda Rackley, and I'm only naming the people that I know of or that I followed. Um, Ashley Reynolds from Cloth and Paper. Um, Maureen Vasquez from Pipsticks, and I'm like, ooh, Danielle, Danielle's messaging me, um, from Pipsticks, and then, um, Kristen Cruz on TikTok, that's the only place that I've seen, that I've known of her, uh, because she sings beautiful, she has a beautiful voice, they have uh, so many more people, uh, Felicia from Goldmine and Coco, really cute stuff, uh, Heather Kell from Kell of a Plan, she's, you know, a lot of people that you're gonna be able to either see, speak, or interact, or do whatever, I mean, it doesn't specify, but I'm super excited. There's more people, by the way. Irene Wong from Simply Gilded. Oh, if I could sit on one of her tables, like she she uh, sponsored, that'd be like, <laughs> um, like she makes really cute stuff. So there's so so many people. And also, I think they just recently added somebody from Erin Condren. I think the CEO. Is it the CEO? Let me see. Uh, Tonia Ms. Vayer. Ms. Vayer. I can't pronounce. I can't pronounce last name. Sorry, but Tonia. Yeah, from Erin Condren. So a lot more other people, I don't, I'm not so aware of, but I'm excited. So this page at the GoWildConference.com, you can get your ticket, gives you information of the speakers, there's pictures. 
um it tells you like the rate where to stay the rate is on it and then pay your full payment plan and that's it but then it's like okay how do you book the room and, and so forth right because that's the situation i was originally in and then they have another one that is for the go you wild university which is the wildforplanners.com i didn't find any info there until i was just googling go wild dallas 2024 so there's support wildforplanners.com that is where it tells you so much more in detail like how if you're making payments uh how to book it gives you the link on where to um look for the hotel like i said i don't think there's any more rooms available because a lot of the stuff has sold out but a lot more information so that support.wildforplanners.com is where you're going to get more information but if they could have just kind of combined it in one it would have been so much easier to like navigate so I don't know but overall yeah i'll put the information down below if once again if it's if you guys want to look at this information all the websites will be listed um in the description box down below so yeah so that was the only thing like if they were like oh what do you think we could have done better put all the information together instead of having three different separate things and la 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 it's a little bit confusing you know especially for old people like me <laughs> I mean, at least I know how to log on to my... Anyways, <laughs> why is that lighting looking so weird right now? Where's my son? Okay, anyways. <laughs> now I'm going to show you guys some of the key stuff that we've created. Once again, please keep in mind, this is primarily for our table gifts. Um, there's a couple of things that I will add to the shop this week, especially like the stickers I can add to the shop. Um, I was originally thinking switching like the Go Wild theme, like the sticker that says Go Wild, but... It's just extra work for myself. And right now, I don't have time uh, the time to do it. <laughs> so it's going to be as is until later on. Maybe I'll readjust it. But it's such a cute design. Just don't use the Go Wild sticker if you don't want to go wild. I don't know. It's still a cute sticker. But I'm going to show you guys. All right? Ready? Here we go. So this one I made today. I don't think I'm going to carry this in the shop. I personally did it for myself because i'm the type of person that if i go to a conference or a meeting i love to take notes if somebody's speaking whether it's a motivational speaker about like whatever it is i love to take notes and i don't know a lot of the people that are going to be attending so i wanted not to just have their names but to have their pictures with their names like to see their faces um and i know i think another shop has done this uh, I saw it, but they just pretty much whatever the pictures they had online is the pictures they just made into stickers, which is fine. Um, but I wanted, you know, I don't like the big stickers. <laughs> I don't do big stickers. So I took <laughs> and I added the little leopard bow and the pictures that they had, the writing, the ones that they used, it was like a white writing. I'm, I'm, where's my glasses? Where's my glasses, Sophie? Like I can't, I couldn't read the name. So I just kind of like edited it. I I wasn't going to hand draw their faces for everyone. So I just took the pictures um, and put their names in black and kind of redid the background a bit. But super cute. This new printer, definitely, definitely printing with great quality. So <laughs> I did this for myself because I want to be able to take my, this is another item, note paper. Look at that. It's so cute. This I'm going to have available. A lot of people have asked me if I could do a PDF file so that you guys can download it. But I'm going to make it a JPEG file because PDF, I have to format it differently and people don't like the crop cuts. I don't like them either. JPEG file, it's an image. You're just going to purchase the image, download it to computer. And then, for example, I use Word. I just add, uh, open my Word app, click the image, drag it, drop it, and you can resize it. You can resize it to a pocket, small size, uh, personal, large, whatever, up to a, a full page. You can do this. So I think I'm going to offer it that way, but I'm also going to offer the printed version. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to offer the printed version for my friends that don't like to print and or don't have the time to do it. But it's super cute. I was like, I need it, no paper. And then the little stickers, I'm going to stick the sticker and put it on the top corner and i'm gonna take notes because that's what i love to do so super cute once again if you if this is something that you guys if you're going to the conference and you might be interested just send me a message i don't think i'm gonna add this to my shop yeah i don't i don't know i think it's just like i said i'm gonna use it but for all of you that are using are you going i come i'll make it available this is something that i will norm, normally carry so that's why i don't want to add it so but super cute it has all the speakers including a shake a dj unshakable so <laughs> it's there then 
obviously the note paper. This size is for me because I'm going to be using a disc system. <laughs> Let me show you real quickly. So my my amazing, amazing from somebody that I've met um, through Instagram. She has an Etsy shop, Jess at J and L so cute. She makes jelly. She's made a, a good amount of things for me, and I, I love the quality and I love just her ideas. She had this disc set up. It had papers. She had different colored discs, but this cover. And I was like, oh my goodness. And then I saw this, which has like extra pockets on it. I'm going to stick my business cards, my whatever it is. I'm going to stick stuff. And I'm going to put paper in here. I'm going to see if it works out. Like, I, I'm hoping that it does. I've never used this, so I'm afraid that it's going to pop out. But once you put everything together in there, I'm hoping that it works out. But I needed something to fit in the size. I'm still yet to buy the disc puncher, um, so I'm gonna. I definitely have to do that. But yeah, this is what I'll be bringing hopefully to the conference because I was originally gonna take Big Papa, but I don't know if I wanna take my LV Big Planner with. I don't know. I'm gonna see, but most likely it'll be this. So yeah. So the papers also super cute. I really love the papers. So simple too. And then we go on into the stickers. Oh, so this is the deco sheet for it. Super cute. This is the weekly because we always do deco and like a weekly. And a lot of people are like, oh, do you do it for this kind of planner? This I don't do a particular planner. Like people have used their stickers on Pocket, Personal, A5, on Journaling, on Hobonichis, on The Cousins. Like so you can pretty much use these anywhere. But look at you. I love that so much. And then we have the little llama llama baby mama. Look at that guy with the bows. I love that collar. Collar. I love the color. Why is that? That's one of the words that I'm always like. Ugh. I love the color. <laughs> is that so weird? Now? Look at it. The little flowers. These are just deco sheets. And I did include uh, days of the weeks because a lot of people are requesting that now <laughs> lately. So I'm like, let me just make it days of the week. Super, super cute. So we have those stickers. These I am going to include um, to the shop because people, when I show, like, when people watch the vlogs, they're like, you're going to carry it, right? I'm like, yeah, I will. And then you guys know I love making little stamp deco stickers. Look at that, the hollow on it with the littles. <sighs> and it says Go Wild 2024. And then I have, like, the die cuts. This is um, Life Isn't Perfect, But My Planner's Friends Are. So cute with the llama and little lulu and all my little friends right there so cute of course the llama once again she is so cute uh and then this is one of my favorite stickers by the way like just the writing and the leopard bow and the uh, that tan background it just makes it pop love it and then because in my shop a lot of people are like oh my gosh can you you know that design the leopard and the I was like, okay, I'm gonna make vellum because that's usually what I do. I When we create a collection, we do our dashboards. And if we don't do dashboards, we do vellum to go with it. So this is the vellum. I think in the shop, I'm gonna I'm gonna include this, but as an option, whether you want it with the go while, so it'll be an extra vellum or not. Otherwise, it will just be like, you know, it's still so cute. I love it. This is a personal size. I love that it's like see-through. <laughs> super super cute so yes so that was that and then i had also mentioned that i wanted to do a savings tracker for the people that are not able to attend this year they can use this to make to start a savings fund for next year 2025 uh, we love budgeting and finances so look at it so cute and it has 12 different spots so for 12 months you figure usually they do go while march april so you'll have enough time oh, it's so pretty so yeah i'm gonna add that and don't tell no one okay <laughs> for all of you that are watching if you are gonna purchase this don't say nothing but i have extras of these i've never used them i've had them and they've just i was gonna add them onto our um anniversary box but i never did and i said how cute would it be if i just because it's just like a pink PVC, um, it's like a cash envelope. I don't know. You can put stuff in there. Look at it. I'm going to include this as a freebie for whoever buys that savings <laughs> challenge. 
I only have like maybe like about 20 or 30. So first, first come, first serve, okay? I'm not gonna advertise this anywhere else. <laughs> Just you guys are getting to see this, you will get the deets, okay? Because <laughs> I'm like, I saw these and I'm like, oh, so cute. And then I'm like, maybe add a little bow vinyl. I don't know. I will definitely surprise you guys. But like I said, I only have like 20 or 30 of those. So yeah, that's that. <laughs> first come, first serve. Then because I was like, ooh, do I do a notepad? I don't want to do a notepad. Um, do I do like a, because I had the sticky notes and then I came across, because I have albums, but I don't want to do like a whole album. It's a lot of extra work. I came across this on my favorite place to shop for things like this um, on Alibaba. <laughs> if you're a small shop, you know, you get the best prices. Uh, but yeah, but it's also always, always, it's tricky to find a good manufacturer. But anyways, the person I, that I do my pins with, which you guys are gonna see, Laurel, she recommended me this this other company. So, purchase. I saw these albums, right? Mind you, I'm not a disc girl. I'm a ring girl, so I've never dealt with disc. I'm always afraid like they're gonna fall, but it's actually pretty, you know. <laughs> so it's an album. The purpose of it is an album. Obviously, you could take the cover, you can take the insides out and use this as a notebook. Use it however you want to do it because the disc system, the plus for it is that you can insert anything that's going to fit on the disc, whether it's inserts, paper, or these. So this album comes with the discs, this three, six, seven, eight discs, and then it comes with the plastic inserts on them. It came all set. It was like, I was like, what? It came all together, right? It comes with 30 inserts, 15 of them are double pocket and it's like loading on this side. So double pocket, 15 of those and one big pocket, 15 of those. So I was like, okay, ding, ding, I'll get these. I'm gonna print out a go wild theme like from the design sticker because you know, um, we have albums that have like the sticker, I love stickers make me happy or sticker addict with the hollow film on top. I love this so much. I, I took, I, I made a reel of it and I posted it on Instagram. So many people, great feedback. So many people harassing me now. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to share this in that Facebook group and they better not take it. No, <laughs> I'm like, hi, I'm posting this. I hope it doesn't get taken down. <laughs> it's still up there. Okay. It's still up there. Super, you know, once again, when, when you create things like this and you don't know, I know I love it. That's why I create what I love, right? I I didn't do cowboy boots. I didn't do the blue bonnet. Like I, I do things, especially I, I myself did this. Sophia helped with the llama. I do things that I love. I love leopards. So I was like, people were like, oh my gosh, that is so cute. Who are you? Brand new people. Another batch of people now, you know, joining us. And thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much excited about this but the only thing is that i'm like these are for my table mate gifts okay <laughs> like i wasn't i wasn't like thinking about it but because when you purchase from alibaba or any chinese manufacturer it's so much it's convenient for you to purchase wholesale so you, not just one piece or i only needed eight pieces because supposedly there's 10 people at a table but i'm going to be with johnny at the table so that minus two there's eight people you have to purchase uh, hundreds, depending what their minimum order uh, quantity is, the MOQ amount. So for them, it was like a uh, hundred. I'm like, okay, minimum hundred, okay. Plus the shipping, la 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 la. I did my vlog, everybody's so excited. Once again, I will be releasing this version on Friday. This whole thing is gonna be $5. No coupon allowed, everybody already knows. People are so excited because it's a really good price. I said, I'm not looking to make, I'm not, my whole intention was not like, well, let me do this and sell it for three, four times, which is what normally companies do. Okay. It's the, it's the real, it's the real. They're paying for the shipping. They're paying for the item and they want to make a profit from it. They want to at least, if not two to three times, or sometimes a lot of places go extravagant amount, whatever, because people are going to pay whatever they want to pay. Right. And other places I said, do carry this same setup and they just put the sticker around. But anyways. I'm going to carry this plain thing. It's going to be there for $5 while supplies last. But a lot of people were hitting me up in regards to selling this as it is from the Go uh, Wild, the Facebook group. I was not expecting 
the feedback like that. I mean, I know it's cute, but I wasn't expecting people wanting to purchase this exact way. I have only enough merchandise for the eight, so I'm going to have to figure it out. I had mentioned that for the releases, um, because I'm going to post a picture of everything on the Facebook uh, page, I think, today. <laughs> I'm just going to see if I can at least do an additional 10 with this, just for the people that are going to be attending. Because one of the things is like when you're there, I've been watching even more videos, a lot of people give you contact cards, postcards, stuff like that. This will be a great way. And a couple of people are like, oh my gosh, I could stick my contact cards in here or I can add paper in there and use this as a notebook while I'm at the conference. I'm like, oh my gosh, I didn't even know about that. She was like, this way I'll have paper. And then as I'm meeting people, I can put the cards in here. And I was like, wow, I wasn't thinking about that. But yeah, so I might, I'm gonna see how many depending on the stock that I have at hand, I might have to order more, but depending, I have to still figure it out. I'll probably have like an additional 10 of these just with the go wild this side. I have also been asked if I can, for my own personal shop, add the littles on it. At this moment, I don't have time to add the little, um, because once again, it's like, <laughs> we're a shop. So I still have to do the other orders that are waiting for me right now. And I have the other new releases. So maybe like in a week or so, I can make time to add the little with the bow. So I'm going to see how it goes because I don't, I don't know how, I don't think people are going to want this, but it seems like it, you guys do. So yeah. So this is going to be also definitely part of our table mate gift. So everything that you're seeing besides the dashboard is going to be included when I do the little table gift. So I can't wait. When people get, when I get to sit on the table and we're giving out and they're like, oh my gosh, we've never heard of you. I'm like, hey, I'm okay. And we make cute things like this. It just makes, it makes me feel so happy. Anyway, so yeah super super cute who knows like it's a really good yeah anyways so that's that obviously if you're thinking well how much is this one if the other one that's playing is five this is 15 dollars. i put the price out there already like <laughs> and i have a few friends that are like i want the album but can you do this oh but what are you gonna do it for them or not these are friends that i've had since we started and anyways don't come at me okay like it's like me making one for my mom if my mom wants one with her name on it of course it's my mom why wouldn't i <laughs> any hoots okay you guys have seen the sticky notepads super cute last but not least i made another reel when i got these both on instagram and i shared it on the facebook group so many people reaching out once again i didn't go crazy ordering large amounts because everything you know i'm paying for like the merch because gifting priority right look how cute and this is a pin it comes with two of them Oh my God, I love this so much. I didn't want to make it so small because then you wouldn't be able to see the details. It says Go Wild 2024, Oki Plants, the Littles and the Two Llamas. Llama, llama, baby, mama. I can't get that out of my head. I love this so much. This one, I told them not to put the hollow glitter because when she sent me the proof, it, it just, you couldn't read. So I didn't want that. So super cute. Still beautiful. I love, I love the color combination. And then... Laurel's like, you know what would look cute because you have the outline of the purple. She's like, you should make it with the purple. It's like a clasp keychain, whatever. You can use these as keychains. I sometimes take it off and use it as a charm, add it onto other things. How cute is she? And this this does have. Did I take the plastic out? I just want to make sure because sometimes when you don't, yeah, I didn't take the plastic out. Sometimes when I don't take the plastic out, you can't see the hollow oaky. Okay. Is that the other side? Yeah. Look at her now. Look at her now. So cute. We got the llama. Did I take the plastic out on this one? Yes. And of course, I had to do the go wild one. I didn't want to put a year because if you could use this forever, whenever, how cute is that? Go wild, baby. Go wild. And not just for the conference, but I like the go wild. Go crazy. Go wild. Get stupid. I don't know. Super, super cute. And this, the purple, I am so proud. I am so proud. But yeah. That's it so far. <laughs> and you guys know me when, for the past two times, well, <laughs> the only times, when we did our shop anniversary and when we did the coffee attic box. Um, and also for, yeah, for the Miffy the Sun, because that was special for me. We handmade magnets. Let's see if I have, it's my planner, it's my baby. I think I have one, I think I have one. Do I have one? Yeah. So this is the one that we did for the anniversary box. It's a cute little magnet. It's not like made a hundred, the best quality. It 
fulfills its purpose. It's so cute though. I clip it there. I think I have another one. I have the Lulu the pig. Oh, yes, we did the Lulu. Where is it? The Lulu. The Lulu's right here. That was Lulu for the coffee attic. So I tend to do those. I don't carry them in my shop at all. I think it's like an extra, an extra added on thing special because not everyone has it. Only for certain occasions. So I decided I'm going to do one. This is just for my table made gifts. And anybody that is going to the conference, I'm going to, I'm not going to post, should I post it? Should I commit to that? I don't know. I was even thinking maybe like making extra. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to include these as our table made gifts. I still haven't finished them, but it's going to be like this. Look at them. I know my friends are right now. No, okay, you better sell. You better give me one. Oh, my close friends, my, my shopaholics that shop every single time that we have new releases. I got you, boo. I got you. But I'm going to make extras of these. I have a good amount here. Get the magnets on and clip them onto my business cards. Also as a meeting. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Yeah, it's extra work and whatever, but I think it's so cute. Like, you ain't going to find this anywhere else. So that's what makes, to me, makes it special. What makes it, yeah. You'll remember us from this boat. <laughs> but it's super cute and it's hollow. Everything is hollow. I try to make a lot of things hollow. And that's what I have so far. For my own personal use, like I said, I'm going to try to set this up. I don't know if I can have time this week or not, but I'm going to try to set this up. That you guys will see on the next episode because you guys know I love me some tabs and I needed tabs. I'm not adding this for releases because I just thought about this. And although people are going to ask me later on when I have time, I'll make some side ones too. I'll take a picture of it and add a, I just don't want to commit to certain things right now because it's like I'll just get ideas, you know. But I'm going to do top tabs only for mine because I don't want it to get on the side. But yeah, that's what's going to be coming in the future to my shop. And I'm excited. I'm so happy about it. Honestly, I'm so grateful. And before we go, because I'm pretty much done giving you guys all the updates, I did want to talk about this. And something that I noticed, and I know a lot of people notice too. One, for that... No, I'm not going to say it like that. What I'm going to say it is this way. <laughs> Be nice, Oki. I just, I don't want people to take it the wrong way. Oh, otherwise, it's nothing, you know, it's just observations, you know. A lot of people that are going there their first time, right? Like me. I'm like, I'm excited about it. I create stuff. So I was like, automatically, yes, I'm going to make some goodies. One, I want to create it. I think it's such a great, I, I love this design. And you guys know, I love to create cute things. Two, it is definitely going to help more people get to know who Oki Plants is, who Oki and Sophia is, the people behind all these cute hand-drawn <laughs> things. <laughs> Gotta add that hand-drawn thing. Why don't you have $2 Tuesdays? Because we hand-draw everything. I'm not going to sell it. Anyways, <laughs> let me stop that. That's going to be on my weekly vlog. But anyways, I knew from the get-go that I was going to create something cute to give away. Okay? It's an investment, not only monetary, but time. I don't mind. I want to do it so bad. I want to be, like I said, one of our, the biggest fears for me is growing, but I know we need to grow, but I'm also afraid that I won't be able to handle it all because my life is not just this sticker shop. My life is my three kids. My life is, you know, my hubby, me, you know, my household, my part-time job. Okay. It's not easy. So a lot of people tend to forget, like when you look at me on the camera and I'm like sharing my stuff, like, wait a minute, what, what else does she do? Yeah. I do a lot of other things. Okay. So I try to like make time as much as i can for the creative aspect for this for everything um so it, it, it's a lot <laughs> it's an investment of my time and love uh, but we enjoy it so much we we truly do so as much as i want to grow and we are growing it's there's always that fear for some reason you know i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna work on it <laughs> Because I do, because I'm like, okay, don't let fear stop you from growing and from, you know, once again, maybe if this year once a holiday mocha, maybe I do need to, I'm, I'm going to have my mom here helping me. So that's going to be a plus, but stop being afraid to grow, right? Because I have always said my goal would be to one day hopefully have a stationary shop, not just to carry our stuff, but like to carry a bunch of different pens or like sticky notepads, little craft place on Instagram. That's where I, I saw them years ago when I first bought my first Hobonichi Weeks from there. And they have a shop. I think it's in Texas too. I believe they're in Texas too. Maybe they're near. I don't know. I'm going to see. 
but they have like you know they carry hobonichis other journals a bunch they have a big washi wall like i would love to have something like that small here and well wherever i'm at if i'm in new jersey or if i move to florida i don't know <laughs> so that's my main goal so i'm not gonna achieve that unless we grow and we create more things and more people know of us and it's building that revenue for it right it all comes down to that so i'm gonna try my best to be like focus on the main goal and not like the fear hold me back from it yeah that's what i'm gonna do but anyways besides that i see i got sidetracked one thing i've noticed is that there's a lot of people i mean once again doing the table gift miss the table mate gifts and i see a lot of comments on that chat uh on the facebook chats but also on the page itself people are like oh my gosh i'm so late i'm starting to make bracelets oh should we make bracelets should we buy this i mean you do not i repeat and they say it on the page too the administrators tell you you do not have to gift anything you don't have to buy nothing if you want to go ahead make it but it's not a requirement okay i know it's hard i know it's hard because we don't want to be the last kid chosen on the line and no we don't want to be the person there with no nothing to give i get it it's like the whole mental thing right if I was in a sticker shop, I'm not going to, I'm already spending so much money on the ticket and the conference. I'm not, I don't, I'm not going to spend extra hundreds to maybe I'll bring like Hershey kisses and here, here's a kiss. That's it. Don't go crazy. Don't put yourself in a bad financial situation. Don't stress yourself out just because you didn't make something or brought something or whatever it is. You do not have to gift anything. You just have to be there and enjoy the experience. Have fun meet new people if you don't have contact cards if you're like well, at least let me get something to give out so people remember my name and you make friends and you change information i would definitely advise how i did with vista print the business cards just grab your picture find somebody i don't know like who's can do it for you it's pretty simple just vista print even has their own design thing upload your picture put your info choose a cute background if you don't want no background or color something is something simple those are pretty inexpensive i would say like they're just they usually have a sale going on that's one route to go or a lot of people are getting like their contact cards made with stickers those costs and it adds up i'm saying if you can afford it great but if it's your first time going and you're already spending so much to get there and it's like don't let that become a burden you know you do not have to gift anything don't stress out let's enjoy the process okay let's just enjoy there going there being there and experiencing it all that's it that's my biggest advice because i see so many people commenting and like getting oh my god i don't know what should i do what should i do people are doing bracelets people are doing mugs people are doing this and i'm like i mean for the table mates gifts yeah but also like people are gonna be gifting bracelets. like that is time consuming i mean it's awesome but Listen, do whatever you want to do, but just know that you're not obligated to gift or give anything. That's it. Yeah, that's it. I'm excited. I'm happy with what we have created. I know the feedback has been so far so good. Once again, I know if you guys watch this and you're like, okay, I'm going to be going to the conference. Can you make me one? I'll definitely make you one. I don't know what the pricing for this would be. Maybe I'll just give it to you as a freebie, okay? Like, <laughs> Just DM me, but I need to have proof that you're going to be there. Like, I don't mind, you know. Or maybe I should I should be business savvy and add this to my shop. No, I don't want to add it. I'm not going to add it to the shop. But if you want this, message me. We'll figure something out. But it is cute. And me, I'm blind as a bat. And I'm going to, I'm not going to remember so many names. Maybe I'll start memorizing. No, I'm not. I mean, Martha Stewart, of course, you know, and Ashley from Cloth and Paper. Cause, and Amanda, because people that I know. But like, if I don't know the rest, a lot of the rest of the people, I don't know. So, I mean, this does help. Anyways, let me take my back words. <laughs> let me take back those words that I just said. <laughs> I'm still not going to add it to the shop. But contact me if this is something that you might be interested. If not, you know what? If you're going to the conference... I'll send, I'll send you the PNG file and you can make it yourself. But if you want me to make it for you, I have to charge you because <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be doing on paper. And this ink, look at the color. Look at the color. But yeah, but if you have your own machine, whatever, hey, I will, I'm going to ask you for proof that you're going to be attending the conference. <laughs> that's, how, that's how, you know, because people be trying to like, I don't want nobody see, taking my PNG file and selling it in their shop and whatever. Not. I've gone through something like that before. That's why I'm always very cautious of what I do. So, <laughs> and I'm such a giver. So I'm like, yeah, free, 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 you know, but anyways, just send me a message. We'll work it out, but it's super cute. 
All right, I'm gonna stop blabbing because I need to clean my desk out, continue on with my orders and my day. Did I forget anything else? Um, no, I think that's it. Once again, if you are planning on going and you've waited this long, don't wait no more, just book your flight. Oh, last but not least, yes. <laughs> Cause I got an email that they're looking for volunteers for the, com uh, for the conference. I keep saying convention. It's a conference. They're looking for volunteers. I think, um, the applications, there's an application you have to fill out. Um, I think it starts February 12th, but I know a lot of people apply for it and only a certain amount get, uh, accepted into helping out. The good thing to it is that if you've already purchased your ticket, they refund half of your ticket for the conference. So that's definitely a plus. I was thinking about it, but then I was like, no, because then I'm not going to get to enjoy the whole experience. Because, mind you, if you're going to be helping out, you're not going to be able to sit down in the conference. Like, you're going to be doing stuff and helping out. So, I personally, if maybe on my second time or third, maybe I'll help out. But on the first one, I want to enjoy the whole experience. So, yeah. But that's definitely something to consider. If you that's something, if you're going by yourself, maybe that's also, you know, an icebreaker and you'll get to meet other people. Once again, I don't know how it will be, like if you'll be able to be there during the speaker time and so forth. So just get the details. I'm going to try to put the link also on the description down below. But yeah, I got the I got the email for that. So super exciting, guys. Um, we'll see what happens until the next episode. Maybe, yeah, because it's already February, the first week of February. Maybe I'll do a recap in March. Oh, yeah, I have to because I'm going to show you guys. Oh, my God. Ladies, I gotta send her the images to, to do the. I wanna get sweatshirts done with the this. With the Go Wild logo. It's gonna be big. And then the back is gonna be the littles with the baby llamas. And a big Texas. No, maybe just the littles. And I wanna do like bows on the. I'm gonna do something cute. So I'm definitely gonna. Yeah, it'll be another episode before the actual conference. And I'm excited. I hope you guys enjoy this uh, <laughs> second episode. Let me know feedback, comments, questions down below. If you want to reach out to me, um, you guys can harass me on Instagram, DM me there, Facebook, preferably not. I'm like I said, I share as much as I can. I'll log in because Delaney girl, Delaney loves Facebook. Lindsay, you love to be on Facebook too, girl. Uh, <laughs> Jennifer Jimenez, yeah, I'm calling you. I love you, girl, so much. Thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> I know you're more on Facebook, so. For the people that I know, I'm always trying to, like, check your messages there. I'm trying my best. Honestly, I'm trying my best. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, as always, I'm feeling good. And I hope you feel good, too. Um, sending you lots of positivity and lots and lots of love. Bye-bye.